Today I'm going to uh, go back and uh, rehearsal uh, for a small rehearsal uh, for bass bar tuning. And uh, this is a viola top. And uh, I glued the bass bar first, uh, like with straight sides, and then I tapered it a little bit to the top. Um, then uh, to establish the height of the bass bar, I go uh, across, like tapping like this. And that's, in my ears, the same pitch, even though I go across like this. Uh, I've done from here and down, but I haven't done this part. So uh, I'm going to show you uh, what it was like before I tuned this and uh, this part here. So we go the same here, like across. Or we can go Can you hear that it's da 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 Higher here And as you know, higher means take away And uh, when you tuned the middle, because you always uh, go from the middle out uh, also when you uh, are tuning the top like from the middle out then uh, you can go like this and you hear it's higher here so you take away here and when that is done you're tuned all the way it's going to sound a little bit like this So it's the same pitch all the way down here. And uh, uh, since this is going to be a new a unit, the bass bar and the top, the pitch should be the same even though I go out on this area where there is no bass bar. So I try it like this. And the pitch follows all the way, even out on the area where the bass bar is not there. Uh, this also tells about the length of the bass bar. Uh, I know that in, uh, well, for instance, Sacconi book, um, they say that uh, the violin should be uh, well, the bass bar of the violin should uh, stop at 40 millimeters from the edge, here and here. I'm not so sure about that. Uh, my bass bars go down and then uh, I cannot take away any more material up here. And the, since the bass bar goes up here, I don't see the support for this last part. Uh, it has to sort of be a convex curve as long as it's supporting when it starts to be concave here it doesn't support anything it's just dead wood so to say so i cut my base bar where uh, well <laughs> where this dead wood occurs so my base bars are slightly shorter than this standard measurement. So on a violin, I tend to go closer to 50 millimeters than the 40. Uh, well, I guess that's it.